in my hand. I hold two putters. Let's see if I can learn to putt with one of them. Now, on JB Goff. What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. If you guys watch my videos, you know I struggle with putting. I have a lot of three putts. So, went had a putter fitting recently. You guys know I got this Scotty Cameron Newport, but one of the ones I really like the philosophy on was this Seymour putting. And uh, so I bought this as well. And let's check this out. And let's put these two to test and see if one works better than the other. So, check out the Seymour putter. The thing I liked about it, you can see that red dot on it. Basically, what it is is you set the putter down, you hide that red dot with the shaft between the two white lines and then you know you're in the same position each time. So let's put this to the test, get us a Scotty Cameron, see if one works better than the other for me. Or if I still just make three putts. All right, to make things fair, each hole, I'm gonna uh, alternate. So the first one, we're gonna use the Seymour putter first. That'll be my first time actually using it. And then Scotty Cameron will go second. Um, basically, once I get in, so if I get in with two putts, if the next one misses the second putt, I'm just calling it and we'll go from there and see after, let's do, five greens and see who comes out on top. All right, round one goes to the Seymour putter. Nice easy two putt. Scotty Cameron, first putt came up, woefully short, and he ran the second way by. So at best it's gonna be a three putt, could even be a minute four putt. So let's go on to hole number two. All right, here, hole number two, Scotty Cameron goes first. Second hole's a three putt for both. Oh, that's me. Um, the Seymour actually, the first putt was better, but it still ran it by. To make the comebacker, so hole half with three putts. And that is one and a half for the Seymour. And half for the Sky Cameron. Let's go on to hole number three. All right, here for hole three, we're gonna do a longer putt and a little bit of a shorter putt. Longer one, a little off the fringe, and the shorter one. Um, so longer one maybe 20 feet, and the shorter one maybe 10 feet, and see if there's any difference there. Again, Seymour goes first on this one. All right, on the long putt, Seymour with a nice two putt. Scotty can get it. So it is now two and a half to half a point. And now let's do this little eight footer. Um, again, Seymour goes first on this hole and then we'll do the same thing on the next hole.
All right, two two putts there. Um, so give him split the point. So Seymour now leads three to one. The Seymour putt was better. I am getting a little bit better distance control with that. But yeah, Jake's put it in the put the ball in the hole. So that's what we're going with. So let's do one more and um, Seymour still win. We'll call it a day. Scotty can win the next two, the next hole though. We'll go to a sudden death playoff. All right, this time we'll go shorter putt first and Scotty Cameron to lead off. So each one with a two putt. So now we get a longer putt. So right now it is three and a half Seymour, one and a half Scotty Cameron. All right, so in all honesty, neither one of those first putts were any good, but I was actually able to make the second putt with a Seymour, so another point for it, and it gets a commanding victory over the Scotty Cameron putter. All right, guys, so based on that, I'm gonna play my next 10 rounds with this Seymour putter again. This little red dot, being able to line it up and know you're in the same, pretty much set up at the same time, she leads uh, lead us some consistency. Uh, if you guys don't know, this is the putter that, this isn't the model, but this is the brand that Payne Stewart used on uh, that famous putt he made to beat Phil Mickelson in the US Open. And it's also the brand that Jack, uh, Zach Johnson used for both his Masters victory and his Open Championship. So, Seymour putter, we're gonna give us a chance, 10 rounds with it, see if our putting improves. We should at least get a consistent setup. Let me know what you guys are using. If you guys have used Scotty Cameron, if you use Seymour putters, what putters you guys like blade, mallets, milled, insert, let me know. As always, if you like the video, hit that thumbs up, get in the comments below, subscribe to the channel, and keep it locked here until next time. I'm JP Goff. Mm -hmm.